I use the word unlimited, unlimited amount of income. So the choice is yours. You want to make unlimited amount of income? Real estate. You want to make limited? Okay, no problem. Real estate. I, I must say from the beginning of this year, January, those of you that know the value of Naira and dollar story, uh, I want to especially appreciate the previous speakers, especially the last one that said, if you see anywhere that is bush, you should go and buy it. I want to start by just one simple story. This year, I think in the month of March, my boss here gave me a bush to sell. He gave me a bush to sell. And so when he told me to sell the bush, so I was bargaining. I said, sir, I must sell at this amount. If you want me to produce results, I must sell at this amount. But if you don't want me to produce results, no problem. But I want to tell you, the property that we started selling for as low as 400 and 50, 440,000 naira, January this year. Currently, this is August, it's selling for 1.5 million. January this year, take your 450,000 to bank, keep it in the bank. August, go back to withdraw it. You will know how much balance you have because you don't have complete. Four hundred and forty thousand dollars. Oh, it's very fantastic. It's very, very fantastic. And then start making it. It's going to be a huge and the time again, the fifth edition, the people of Abima have not seen what's coming to them. Seize this opportunity and give You know, basically, this right organization, they saw like, a gap in the waste of time, in the waste of time. time. Um, and I will meet you on the change section tomorrow. And I will be exposing those gaps. Yeah. Those yeah. Yeah. You should not buy land and leave it empty. It was possible. You waste so much money on data. Everyone, megabyte, for every one gig I spend, I'm going to make money from it. And before the end of one week, for me, one Sir, dollar, briefly, dollar, give us one solution to real estate and agriculture solution. Thank you very much. One solution. Uh, one solution. Well, basically, no land in those states, any other state, no land should be left. Thank uh, you very much. Thank you uh, um, the if you consider is here, yeah, the, here the kind today. of uh, people that uh, came here, the people that attended, of uh, Adewale, of Hoi, Ajagbade, of Ode Kingdom, Echeka Biesio, Metala, Koba, Ladi, Echeka Biesio. Okay, briefly, sir, what is real estate all about, sir? What real estate is all about, sir? Yes. Yes. What real estate is is all about Yoko, Gabi, you. we're happy to have you, you here know, and we'll move on trying to do business thank you very much and with property. Property. let's now you know, invite I want to real estate investment you have a real estate we're not talking about real estate we're talking about land so when I'm talking about real estate investment we're trying to make an enterprise the citation will be Online marketing. I started running ads. I was paying money to run adverts. I was paying influencers on WhatsApp also. And trust me, they really, really paid off. The advice I would give to people coming up in real estate, some young realtors, is that <laughs> it's not going to be easy at the beginning. Like I said, I made those sales initially. It was really frustrating. I've talked to people, some persons would not even want to like pick your calls or talk to you, like so many ups and downs. But if you can be very consistent, see ahead of those times, like believe that yes, you one day sell and also have a target, not just wake up in the morning. Ladies and gentlemen, without any further ado, let's make a record for Nelson. You can't talk about anything with time. So for me, real estate All right, and thank you very much for the sake of time. Let's settle down. Uh, gentlemen and everybody, and if my young, you know, several times I see people come to my office and all, and uh, so you ask them, what's your budget? They said, I have a million naira. I'm not going to pray. 
you tell them, okay, we'll have to come to your young people. Bakure, woke up and the moment they go there and come back, they tell them, that place people. is too far. And they have bad plans. Yeah. This Somebody needs to do something. This story. We need to turn this uh, land into a I stay around and that has a place been called the Shekho Prince. And that is what Eka, brings about it. Cuts. We are called. A pot of land there currently is going to be for 90 million. It will right. own those states. And the reason he brought uh, it is because years ago, he wants to see it. As recent as five, six years ago, that is lying fallow and lying idle. That is the major reason. That is the major reason. He called plan seven, ten years ago. And the first of this same land was selling for just 450. We don't just buy proxies. There are things we see for buy proxies. We want to show people government. Most times we want to ask, ah, help us not go into the next road project you want to. I don't know what to do in road. We never announce our money. But I think we'll announce our next week. Sir, if you buy a project in this neighborhood, we pack an access road for, let's say, a million naira. The moment an announcement comes, that the road will pass, not even close to the land though, maybe two kilometers away from that land, the value of that land doubles. The value of that land doubles immediately, it becomes two million naira, sir. If mistakenly any of your neighbors carry white sand voting for your land and pack a few plus, you know that the foundation, they don't have machines. The moment it's that foundation, please not become buying and build. Of course, you know how much it is plus. So why would you keep to that? Why would you keep to that market? The complete thing about it is that it affords you the opportunity to step into real estate with little finances, little capital. That now, those numbers that are selling for 500,000, 1 million, 1.5 million, they're buying them now. Buy them for the future. You ask yourself what you want to do with it. That's money in your account. What do you want to that money do? You know that if you leave money in the bank, you, you, you make money for the bank. I think a couple of times my account officer will come and meet me. He says, ah, you want you to leave certain amount of money in your account for like six months. Can you please help me? It's going to help you my rating. But I'm only asking that I'm an investor, I'm a businessman. If I need that money, what is the value of the money for me? Money is expensive. There is a cost to money. You understand? If I can't have money down to an investment, I know my portfolio is growing. I can see my investment grow. This is what land banking can do for you. So, basically, key up to an estate company. Understand where the city is developing, buy it. There are factors that influence this development. What you need to do basically as an investor, a potential investor, is to study the trends, study the market, understand where this city is, where these things are going to happen. You understand? A Botacot. Most of the trading areas are you hear a lot of estate companies announce Abara. And ask people and the rest of them. Of course, and ask them. But then, for the prices, you could tell areas that are high catchment areas, areas with high potentials, that offer higher returns on investment. Study this. Make sure that this one is a genuine. Our documentation should have been intact before we step up and start selling. Buy from these companies. You need to get this very important. All you need to do is to study, research the company you want to invest in. Just like you know, it. research the company. These are all what I'm banking for. Gentlemen and ladies, you're here. We have a lot of reasons. I'll send a few of them. Some of them are interesting. You know that they're not going to be there. Happens to one of the oldest, if not the oldest, real estate company in the city. Yes, sir. 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 This is a feat that very few companies are actually trying to do. If you understand the, the, the dynamics of real estate, any company that survives, any investor company that tries for 34 years, years. For him to have survived, he's done. He knows what he's doing. It's not coincidence. It's not coincidence. He won't understand this very well. So, keen on that is a good decision. They must still trust you to know that Pastor Francis at the Kunda Debeu is still the state chairman for Rivers Estate Developers Association. He's also the vice chairman of Freedom for River State. This is a man with all the contacts, all the information, all the principles to turn your investment around. If you're thinking of investing, or you're thinking of joining him as a, as a real boy, Thank you very much. We really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. If you have questions, please.
we have your name on this. Zay Jensen, right, we are glad to introduce to you the host of Real Culture Sun, Apostle Francis Adekunle Adepero. Apostle Francis Adekunle Adepero is a real estate professional and the MD CEO of Renovate Estates, one of the foremost and most vibrant real estate companies in Nigeria, notable for creating optimal solutions in land development, housing, and real estate. With over two decades of corporate existence, through the creation of innovative solutions and easy house ownership schemes, Renovate Limited has contributed immensely towards elevating the housing deficit issue in Niger with an uncompromising commitment to excellence and character as a corporate culture in professionality, service delivery, and customer experience. Apostle Francis Adekunle Adebero is well known for his business and entrepreneurial his entrepreneurial okay, acumen um, and astute investment strategies has earned him numerous accolades and recognition. And, uh, he was the recipient uh, of the award veteran by the Chicago Business School and Entrepreneurs to, uh, Development Center in 2023. He was also the nominee for the Oga at the Top Award in 2024 as one of the top three decisions in real estate. He is the vice chairman of the Real Estate Developers Association of Nigeria, Red Real Estate Chapter, and the servant chairman of the Okay, Yes, real culture can tackle culture. Apart from me, I like that. Why do I say that? Because real culture addresses two of the basic needs of every human being. Number one is food, and the second one is shelter. You know, the third one is saying, we have several locations for that. Real culture is positioned to take care of the to shelter and to put them all safe. So if you can tackle these two problems, then definitely we know that we are right. And the process of the place of appreciation where we are not ready for the development, like we, have we are said also engaging that same land. Subscribe to Rule Code and in the profit. Passive.